Hi friends, welcome to my channel. If you have not subscribed, kindly subscribe. Today we will watch a video on the soundbar JBL bar 2.1. The unit comes with a wireless subwoofer and has a total power output of 300 watts. It supports Dolby audio and has JBL surround sound. We will look more details in the video. We also have a detailed sound demo at the end. So please watch till the end. Let's get started. The packing is really attractive. I bought this from Reliance Digital Shop and got this for a really good price of less than 22,000 rupees including a 3 year warranty. Before purchasing I was shown a demo of its performance and I really liked that. Now we have opened the pack, on the bottom is the soundbar and on the left side is the subwoofer. The soundbar's length is around 96.5 cm and the build quality is really good. Since the graphics look attractive, I haven't removed it yet. On the top, we have power on off, volume minus plus and the source selection buttons which are easy to operate. On the back, we have an AC in. Aux in, USB, optical in, HDMI in and HDMI out. The subwoofer is down firing and looks really stylish and the finish is great. On both sides we have the JPL symbol. On the rear we have subwoofer vent, subwoofer pairing button, AC in and input for software upgrade. Separate power cables are required for the subwoofer and the soundbar. The subwoofer pairs easily without any issues. This is the bottom side of the subwoofer. The driver size is 16.5 cm. An accessory box is included in the package. Let's see what's in the accessory box. Wall mount unit, measurement paper template which helps in wall mounting, quick start guide, optical cable, aux cable two power cables
and a remote. On the remote we have from the top left the power button, source button, volume and navigation controls, audio sync buttons, bass control, mute button, sound mode to select preset equalizers like standard, music, voice, movie and sports, bluetooth button, sound shift button to easily switch between different devices, shuffle, surround on off, night mode and dim display to control the LED brightness. The night mode helps in normalizing the volume. I have set up the unit now. Now let's have a detailed sound demo. We will first look into some Dolby Atmos trailers and NCS music. I would suggest using a headphone to get the best effect. This demo is a bit lengthy, thought of giving a better feel. Is it? This is black. 
This is contrast that reveals details deeper than any image you've seen on the screen. This is luminance that means the difference between light and pure energy. Energy that is about to reveal an entire universe of color. in the cinema. This is my still functional Philips 5.1 multimedia home theater system SP090 with an output of 100 watts. I really liked this soundbar and is suitable for a medium to large room. The maximum volume is 50 and for me 16 to 18 produced enough volume. 
the rumbles from the subwoofer is amazing and adds to the thrill of watching movie music sports or any content since i have not used any other soundbar i cannot give a comparison but it's worth it you will not regret thank you for watching please comment share and like the video we'll meet you soon with another interesting video till then goodbye and take care